better to reflect on that legacy than the great Rick Jenneret. I'd done that for the last time in front of 20,000 people in a TV audience, but not so, and am I ever glad it was not the last time. For more than 20 years, here in Buffalo, we were spoiled by the play of two men who made one of the hardest positions in sports look easy. First, we had Dominic Hasek. Talk about a tough act to follow. But then, in 2002, arrived this young man from East Lansing, Michigan. And we watched him grow up alongside many of the alumni who sit on the stage today. From the rookie trying to find his way to, at the height of his career with the Sabres, the best goaltender on planet Earth. Ryan's style was not the theatrics of the Dominator, but he was every bit as intense. Calm, under pressure, hardworking, honest, authentic, and perhaps most of all, he was proud. As proud as anyone to wear this uniform, to play for all of us here in Buffalo, to live and selflessly give back to the community. And now, Ryan, it's me who's proud to be your neighbor in the rafters. And I can tell you, as someone who has been fortunate to witness the entire history of this organization, there is no one more deserving. And one more thing, Ryan, one more thing. We know what a deep connection you had with so many kids battling cancer through your work with Courage of Carly. So it's only fitting that we honor you this way. The Sabres would like to officially announce the creation of the Ryan Miller Legacy Fund, an endowment established at Roswell Park to benefit pediatric cancer patients. This gift from the Sabres will grow year over year through support from the team, our players and staff, and the fans in this great city. In recognition of you and the Ryan Miller Legacy Fund, Roswell Park will be dedicating this wall in your honor for all that you continue to mean to the thousands of patients, caregivers, and staff who are in the fight. And now, Ryan, would you please come and join some special guests here tonight? We have Luke, Jack, Sydney, Nathan, Sarah, Silas, Mia, and Maria, representing all Courage of Carly members, past and present, families that are on hand here tonight, more watching at home, and those who are with us in spirit. As a sign of their gratitude, they would like you to have this symbol of the work Carly started, carrying the flag on behalf of pediatric cancer patients, and that you now will continue to carry in her honor. Ryan, we thank you and are honored to carry on your legacy in Buffalo.
And now, a tribute fitting a legend. <laughs> 